Hey guys, quick video here. Um, I'm just doing this really quick vlog because my Elgato and my PS4 are not working. Um, turn on the light. Um, so, yeah, quick video. I'm just going to show you what's going on. Uh, really messy setup right now. Uh, laptop ran out of charger. I can't be bothered to get a charger. That's also got the software for the Elgato setup, but I don't think it's going to work because of the problem that I've got. And, um, let me just go to Twitch. I've managed through the PS4 to get it streaming. I'm streaming right now. And, um, see we've got four people in here. I'm so sorry for the people who think this is actually a stream. It's not. Um, this is live right now. But as you can see, I've got no screen. And as you can see, HDMI cable from the PS4 all the way down. We're going to follow it. This one is the one out of the PS4. And um, see, as you can see, it links all the way into the HDMI in. It's plugged all the way in. And then the HDMI out and the USB for the PC to go to the Elgato is in, as you can see. Uh, sorry for showing my feet. <laughs> and then uh, the HDMI into the back of the TV goes up there and is actually in the back of the TV. Let me just get down. It is that wire there. It's fully in and everything. So that's it. Um, so that's when I've got it into the Elgato. Uh, we've now got five people in the stream. See, this is awesome. When I actually can live stream, no one ever comes in. But when I go to, so I was trying to watch a live stream of a friend, but um, here, as you can see, my Elgato just keeps doing this. This is all my Elgato keeps doing. It's trying to uh, set up, and here it kind of keeps saying, look, like, protected by, content, uh, content protected by HDCP, there you go quickly flashes up now I know how to fix that you have to go into your PS4 settings and everything and you have to unclick or uncheck the um, HDCP but the only problem with that is no matter what I do I cannot get this screen to go so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you what happens when this screen um, is from instead of the Elgato which obviously don't work it's just gonna be the HDMI cable from the TV to the PS4 so let's do that now so we're going to take the one out of the PS4, right there. I'm going to go down here. I'm going to take the one that's obviously linked up to the TV. There's quite a lot of wires down here. I'm going to take this one, and then I'm going to bring it up here. Please stay there. Please stay. Stay. Good wire. Right. I'm going to plug it into the USB port and get it in one hand. Go on, get in. Yep. There we go. So that's in. It's firmly in. Won't go any further. Uh, same for the one in the back of the TV, sorry if that screen is pretty bright. So, as you can see, it's not connected to the Elgato anymore, it's not bugging out the Elgato, or Elgato, whatever, <laughs> whatever it's pronounced. Um, so we've still got that, and as you can see, it's plugged into the TV and the PlayStation. I've tried this with both HDMI cables, both of them were working this morning because I streamed with them and everything. And if I keep going on HDMI, which is the setting that I have to have for this TV, nothing will work. Absolutely nothing. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to turn off my PS4. This is also going to stop the uh, stream. I'm going to turn off my PS4. Um, so I'm going to have to memorize. This is what I've been doing. I've been memorizing like, all the stuff. So nice pajama bombs there. <laughs> Right, so we're going to hold down the button, and then I'm pretty sure it's you just spam it all the way down to the bottom. And this will be to I think, turn off device. Come on. So then, I think we go one. Is it one up from here? Try it one up. X. And as you can see, something's happening. And it's maybe putting in a rest mode, which is what I didn't really want. This is going to rest mode. Um, then we're As you can see, it's obviously turned off PS4 because we've gone back to stream off. Um, so yeah, it's gone into rest mode now. So we'll just wait for it to completely power off. I did not want to put it in a rest mode. Just going to wait for it to power off. So 
so I'll skip to where it powers off. Right, so I've actually just pressed the button, I'm holding it now. It's just double beeped. I think this will take it out of rest mode. So I'm not sure. Yeah, that's taken it out of rest mode, so the, the whole PlayStation is powered down now. You can see, no light. It's completely off. Alright, so we're going to hold the button. There's one beep. You can see. It should bring up safe mode. So there's two beeps. It should bring up safe mode. It will not bring up a screen. I can guarantee it will not bring up a screen. It should be on safe mode right now, but it's not. All the wires are completely in fine. I've got no screen. So, what we need to do is turn on this. Instant on. We're on safe mode, but we actually can't see the screen. But trust me, safe mode's there. So what we need to do now is go, I think, down one. And it's the resolution. And we hit OK. And this should restart the PS4. And it should be in a different resolution. As you can see, it's gone blue light. Loading. Loading. I've been up for more than 24 hours now, so 24 hours and 30 minutes I've been up for. Yep. So anyway, white light. Now we're gonna. I think it should be. We turn this on. All right. So the controls on. So we should be on the first part where it says which account you want to go into. So we press X and this will bring me into my actual account <coughs> what we need to do is press up go all the way along to the end so I guess we're at the end now and then we go one more that way so settings tab we should be hovered over we go into the settings and then we got to go down by 8 to get to the video and sound thing I think it is um, so we go down one Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, X, and then it's X again, I believe. And then I think it's X again. And what should be on, if it was on screen right now, the thing that popped up inside saying automatic 480p, 720p. Uh, 1080i and 1080p. <coughs> now I have no idea what to do for my um, thing. It should be hovered over 420p now. So we're going to go down one and down two. So now we should be hovering over the 1080i. I'm going to go for the 1080i, and something should happen. This should really restart the uh, PS4, <coughs> but um, nothing's happened. So. I've done everything I can, I've memorized it from watching YouTube videos and stuff. <clears throat> I'm kind of losing my voice now because I've been awake for quite a while. So I'm going to upload this video and hopefully someone can help me. So thanks for watching, if you can help, comment down in the stream below, oh, um, the stream. I've been streaming quite a lot lately. Comment down in the video below and yeah, so thanks for watching. Um, I hope you can help, someone please help me because this is really annoying. Um, so yeah, so thanks for watching and peace out.